Sophomore of the visiting Detroit Pistons. At shooting guard, Josh Richardson. At the other guard position, Devontae Graham. At power forward, Jeremy Grant. At center, Marvin Bagley III. At the other forward position, Sadiq Bay. The head coach of the visiting team, Dwayne Casey. Allie LaForce is Grizzlies. And for their matchup with Detroit, that's going to be a nice test for them. They'll get a chance to see just how they play against a team that most feel is better than them. Now let's check out the starters for the Detroit. Is guessing they don't know who to try to take away. Here's Book Knight. An important role in this offense, averaging around 12 and a half per game. Graham finds Graham. And a... 105 left in the first quarter. Pass to Graham. Let's go with a three. Count it. His third and five attempts. A credit. Outside Graham. Grant the pass to Johnson. Count it. A Jeff Milikina. He's checked in for the Pistons. And the defense wouldn't give it to him. Here's Siakam. And it's blocked by Ibaka. And that's how you do it. Ibaka still able to surprise people very quick off the floor. Half comes to an end. We've got a close game going here. Hornets out in front. They lead by two. All right, Allie's ready to go. She's courtside. Hey, Allie. Thanks, guys. I'm alongside Coach James Grego. And, Coach, a nice effort so far. What's the key here in the second half, though? Stay with our defense. That's the key. When we have our opportunities, push the pace. But we got to get stops, push it at them, and uh, keep in a rhythm offensively at our point. Defense leads to offense. Thanks, Coach. Thanks very much, Allie. And, folks, we'll be right back to start the second half of this game. Welcome, folks. It's halftime, and the Charlotte Hornets are in the midst of a very close game. Efficiency, you know, I, I think that's big. That's a key to success. You got to protect the basketball. You can't make those risky passes that lead to highlight film dunks. So I thought it was a great job. And moving on, let's take a peek at how the East is shaping up here in the midseason. Look here now at Charlotte. They knew it was going to be a tough year. And I got to say, it's been hard to watch them fight. Looking through all these challenges. We hope they're learning something out there. Challenging time for the franchise. And that is going to do it for us. Let's get back to some second half action with Brian Anderson and company. For first round picks, of course, he also signed a giant free agent contract in the summer of 2020, showing you just how much teams value Jeremy Grant's skills. The Pistons trailing. If you're just joining us, we've played just over a minute here in the third. Knocks down the triple. Bay's got his third. 34 seconds left in the third quarter. Going inside from deep. Johnson. And the Pistons. Another three. Here in the Siakam. And that one's good. Bagley. That's good planning and that's good execution. And that's a great look. The Hornets have gone 7 to 4. Graham, right side. Pass to Bagley. Doubled by Dunn. Over to the wing. Graham for three. Counted from distance. Great. That's what you have to do. Blood shots, blood shooters. They come through in those positions. Now here's Graham. 
low. Here's Bagley. And a great keep up defensively. Graham, the pass to Bay. To tie it up. And the Pistons, another three. Pass to Bagley. Bridges on the double. Back to Graham. Five to shoot. Richards took the three. Another possession. Quarter here. For three. Another three for Detroit. It really feels like. There's 25 seconds left in the fourth quarter here. For three. Another three for Detroit. It really feels like. Uses his body so well to create problems. So we see the Pistons get the win here. Just a gutsy performance on the road. It really was. When this one was up in the air late, they showed how tough-minded they are as a team. And that'll do it, folks. For Steve Smith, Grant Hill, 